let's say you obviously i know she's 96 but clearly she's pretty strong yes let's say you had to do this for another 10 years <laughs> what does that look like to you what does that feel like to you you know like how do you make it through that i think i just need to be able to schedule more time with us a lot of times it's about doing a task doing a task mm -hmm. when we were remote you know i would go see her and we would go out and have some something to eat or we would have a day plan okay so uh, mm -hmm. because we hustle and bustle a lot of times right. those day mm -hmm. times they become fewer even mm -hmm. though she's right next to me right so i just need to pay more attention to those times when we can sit down and speak because right. she likes to talk and okay. she likes to tell me a lot of stuff and i think you're right because as caregivers we kind of get lost in all of the things we have to do and we can sometimes miss the quality time is i think what you're saying absolutely and it's because you're there's so many tasks you have to do for the person and you have to work and you have to do whatever <laughs> else that you're kind of just so focused on getting everything done that you actually don't do a lot of quality time which in hindsight for me i cherish those memories that we have 